Greetings, fellow retro survivors, and welcome to episode part two of Ned's Adventures. Let's hop on over here. Actually, something happened while we were away. Something strange. We wake up back in the mall loading docks. We're covered in some kind of a black tar substance. As we wake up, we realize that that black tar substance is actually probably a bunch of zombie blood. We have shelled peanuts covered over our body. We're confused. We remember being at the manor, raiding it, killing zombies. But we don't quite remember how we got here. <laughs> Truth be told, um, I had recorded a short 20-minute playing session, and as I uh, cleaned up my hard drive, I erased it. So we're missing a little 20 minute. Let me recap really quickly what happened. Basically, uh, it was getting really late when we're at the manor, so I disassembled the fridge to get a rubber hose. Then I siphoned off some gas from a, near to a nearby vehicle and filled up this pickup truck right here. It's our new car. And then I drove back to the mall, and uh, there was about 20 zombies in front of the loading dock. Kill all of those zombies. And then we had a quick night's sleep, and uh, we woke up now at 5 a.m. So, what's going on? What are we going to do? <coughs> well, one thing's for sure is the manor still has uh, the basement to explore. But uh, now that we have a crowbar and a decent armor and weapon, and as I mentioned, I believe in the last video, in the first video, uh, Chainmail is very, almost overpowered, uh, considering that we're playing with mundane zombies. So, we're definitely ready to go exploring the mall. What I'm hoping to find is at least a mess kit, because it's always really cold in the morning and at nights, and all the liquids we have freeze, so we can't drink. So that's why we're kind of hungry and thirsty right now. So, we still have some meat jerky. Oh, and it's actually frozen to the point that we can't even eat it. Ay ay ay. Okay. So, let's dump... Uh, what is this? The toolbox? Oh yeah, I started unloading some stuff that I brought in the car. I loaded up the, uh, the trunk of this pickup here and... Uh, oh, we don't have any food in there, do we? Cigarettes? No. Damn. All right, but I think there's food and this. Yeah, there we go. Ah, 86 calories and more peanuts. Hopefully we're not allergic. Oh, we're dehydrated. Ooh, that is probably not good. Yeah, eating the peanuts was a bad idea. Okay, let's dump stuff that we won't need. Oh, we, see, we have stuff to drink. We have a V8, can of V8 and three bottles of plastic water, but we need to... Maybe we should just make a fire. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Let's see. An electric fire starter. We need copper wires or just wires and scrap metal. Hmm. Where could we find wires? Is there a fence somewhere nearby? Uh, anyways, let's dump. Uh, let's keep the aspirin. Calcium tablet, bandage, yeah. We don't need the cocaine. We don't need the sinew. Pocket knife, nah. Well, might as well, probably. Yeah, it has no volume. It just weighs a, a third of a pound. So let's keep it. We have the makeshift crowbar. Uh, we could, yeah, the flashlight we can skip, keep it with us. That makes us have about almost seven liters of volume and plenty of weight. All right. So I could find a lighter. Yeah, actually. Ah, shit. Oh my god, my stats are crap. Why? Are my stats so oh crap? 
Oh, because I have a cold head and mouth, it's actually messing with my speed. That's not good. Hmm. You know what? Let's let's go outside and see if we can't find a lighter in a car. Actually. Oh, bacon. Ah, oh, it's frozen too. God damn it. All right. Is it raining outside? No. It's still really dark. It's snowing though. Is there maybe uh Got items on the ground? Hmm. No. <sighs> Damn it, a lighter. No lighters anywhere? I usually uh, hoard up on a bunch of lighters and I have too many. What's this E here? Ooh, an evac shelter. Huh. Because there's a fireplace at the manor, I could make a fireplace there, but uh... Oh boy. Let's go exploring them all and hopefully find a lighter somewhere. Now with the makeshift crowbar we can stay in the service hallways, which are usually clear of zombies. Ah, oh, this is the movie theater, I guess. Oh crap. Did they spot me? No? Good. Oh, I should have checked if I can see uh, uh what's the makeshift crowbar is capital B <gasps> An office What? Oof Nah, we're fine. I feel guilty killing the zombie child. We don't have a choice. Zombie find a lighter somewhere oh boy okay this is not super good all right let's just avoid the horde here it's a little sprint they saw me in the light but that's okay I'm just desperately trying to find a lighter here I uh, don't think there is a method to my madness at this point. I'm really just trying to... I know it's locked. I want to pry it open. Oh, I can't. Oh, I'm getting weak. Oh, my goodness. Spotted a zombie. What is this? A beauty magazine and a soap bar. Meh. I don't really need this right now. Oh goodness, we're really starting to struggle. Oh, okay, this is a kitchen. Is there a lighter? A spoon in the glass plate? No. So we're prying open the back store doors for various shops. This is a clothing shop. I don't want anything in here. What about here? This is one of the good things of starting in the mall is that you'll you'll have access. To, ooh, soldering. So this might be an electronic shop. Smartphone, more soldering. Maybe there could be some copper wire. What is this? An antenna? Ah. Disappointing electronic shop. So as I was saying, this is one of the advantages of starting starting the mall is that you'll have access to a lot of small shops and it'll help you uh, find various components to craft. See, he bought, he bit me, but it doesn't matter. Ooh, under the hood, mechanics book. Very good. What's this? Uh, <laughs> it's a medical marijuana shop. <laughs> or, well, you know, if it's legal, it's not medical. It's Cannabis shop, period. Man, if there's an office, there could be. Oh, shh. What's that? A hairpin? Uh, door's locked. Uh, 
Man, I've never had this much trouble finding a lighter. I mean, as the time goes by, my the the drinks and meat will unthaw, which will be good, but we definitely need a lighter in the long run. Oh, great. There's a zombie here. My torso encumbrance, yeah. Chainmail is really good, but damn, is it... Oh, what is this? Ooh, M1911. Yeah, let's, let's take that. That could be useful. A loaded handgun. And uh, even if it's a handgun that you're not interested in, I always take all the ammo. <gasps> oh, fruit wine. Does that quench my thirst? A little bit. Oh, and it's making us strong because we're drunk. Yeah, baby. Okay. I'm not sure this is uh, very wise here because this is just a liquor store. Always oh, smash up those bodies. So Ned's making his way to the liquor store, smashing a bunch of zombies and splattering their brains all over the walls. Uh, zombies spotted, ignore. As long as he's not approaching, we're good. Ooh, a glass of ethanol. Really? Ooh, that might be practical. Okay, we're not running. We're not running. Ooh, oh, can of chicken, whatever. Eat that. Thank you. He's pulped. So what did you have? You have a flashlight? A desk fan. Oh, there's copper wire in a desk fan. Disassembling this item takes about 30 seconds. I might yield one scrap metal, three plastic chunk, one micro motor, and two copper wire. I think we already have one copper wire. And I think we need three for an electric fire start. Wow. <laughs> Can't even find a lighter. We'll have to make a makeshift one. Eh. That's the beauty of this game. Alright. Let's see if there... What is this? Ah, uh, this looks like a, an office. Ah. Come on. You're dead. Maybe they have some good stuff. I'm sure we could find a zombie with a lighter on them. I uh, don't know why I'm doing this. Bathroom stalls rarely have anything of interest. Wow, two hammers. Ow, I'm blinded? I'm really getting cold. Maybe I should have uh, looked at that... Uh, Ooh, BB gun ammo. Meh. Is it made of lead? Steel balls. Alright. Hmm. I don't remember. Where were the zombies here? Is there a horde up here? Ooh, close, close, close. Long sleeve shirt fits. Let's grab it. What are these gloves? Winter gloves. Oh, won't mind if I do. A waistcoat. No, <laughs> oh, that's fine. Maybe if we have a casino night. A pair of leather gloves. I'm already full. It's probably the desk fan. How big are you? One, one liter only? It's probably the guns. Glass bottle. I don't know. Okay. Um, oh, there's a scarf. Wear the scarf. And then we'll tighten. If you activate the scarf, tighten it. So Ned tightens the scarf around his freezing mouth. The spring is rather nippy. So how are we doing heat-wise? Ooh, not good. Torso at minus 25. What am I wearing? I only have a long sleeve shirt and my chainmail armor, which probably gives no warmth. I'm surprised that they weren't mean and gave it a negative value. Because uh, I'm pretty sure wearing chain a full suit of chainmail armor in early spring must not be the warmest thing ever. Okay, let's get out of here. Since I believe we have enough to build that. Uh, lighter, we're just gonna. Oh. Oh. 
Wait a minute. How? Ah, uh, crap. I have to go back out that way. Okay. Is this a beauty salon? I guess. Ah, oh, shit. Alright, we can get, make our way out here. Oh, we were already running. God damn it. Gotta watch out when you st start running because you can. Ooh, multivitamin. Oh, shit. What is that? Calcium tablets? Eh. Ooh, this plaza is really well lit. We don't wanna. Uh, spotted? Ignore. Okay. At least you're dead. You're not coming back. I think I might have left a few zombies here and there unsmashed. Where's the... Man, we're still far. What's this? Clint Berry. Oh, the NPC that... Oh, no, no, no. Uh, I'm just... Ned's slowly walking in the darkness here, trying to avoid the hordes. Desperately trying to find his way back to the loading docks. Where are we? Where are the loading blocks? Oh, they're over here. Okay, okay. Uh, you're pulped and you're pulped. Yeah, once we... Ah, uh, let's... I keep freaking... Ah, uh, the door is smashed here. Um, hopefully nobody saw me. In any case, it's pretty big detour to get to the loading docks from there, so... Should be good. Whew, made it back. Okay. So, uh, we're gonna need some light, so let's just turn on the flashlight. Uh, the door is closed, yeah, perfect, we're fine. Alright, so, where's my flashlight? Actually, I have two to turn it on, super bright. Actually, we'll have to find something better than a flashlight to light us in the darkness, but it'll do for now. Or wait, did I bring something, like a lamp? So that's the copper wire. A broom. Well, a broom will be able to use to make a spear. Because you either need long sticks or a broom. And we have a broom. No. No. Nope. Alright, so let's disassemble this fan here. Uh, and I have the toolbox right under me, so I'll probably be able to use that. Yes. Ah, success. We put it on the floor. No problem. Electric fire starter. Oh no, it's not three copper wires, it's three wires or 30 copper wire. Damn. How much gas is left in the car? 7%? What's that? Taser and batteries. Yeah, you know what? Screw this. Still frozen? God damn it. We need a mess kit or something. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Or we can go find an RV that has still some battery life in it and maybe use the, the cooking unit inside of that vehicle. Yeah, let's try that. Although, man, there's going to be so many zombies. Let's try not to hit the zombies, because, oh, which will not be hard, because there's a lot of them. Okay, is there any RVs? Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's copper wire there. Just laying there. Is it safe to get out of the car? No. Let's see. Stop the car. Uh, stop driving. So we turn off the engines and get ready to jump out of the car running towards the copper wire, which is slowly revealed. Oh, this is slowly becoming a bad idea. Yeah, they're surrounding the copper wire as if they know that we need it. Bastards. Let's start slow to a walk. Let's try to kite them. Ooh, yo, 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 yo. Success. We grab the copper wire. Very good. A vacuum sealer. That's not 
more copper wire. But it's right under the car. Get the copper wire. Oh yeah, we got it. Hey, what's in the, the trunk here? I can't see items in trunks. Duct tape. Okay, that's good too, but we don't really need that right now. Uh, is there another car that has maybe a lighter in the front seat or something? Alright, let's go look at this. Pack a cigarette. What's here? A small fire extinguisher. That's useless. Oh, this is slowly becoming a bad idea, so let's get out of here. Oh, no, 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 no! No! The zombies have jumped over the car. Engine fails to start. Alright, we're gonna back up like crazy. Hopefully. Oh my god, we backed out of there like a madman. Ah, oh, fuck you, zombie. You're dead. Oh my goodness. This is not good. Hopefully the car isn't in complete mess. Let's have a quick peek at you. Ah, oh, the engine was already in a really bad state. How are the wheels? Ooh. The front left wheel is almost destroyed. The back wheels are fine. Muffler is gone. <coughs> Security system was already broken. Ooh, a frame just broke. That's weird. The frame's broken, but the seat's still there. That's not supposed to be like that. Oh, there's more copper wire here. How much copper wire do we have now? Ten. We need thirty. Oof. Is there maybe more on the floor? Bubble wrap, cash cards. Here, let's filter by copper. No? What about on this side? Yes, a bit more. So this isn't good. I don't know how, why, but now there's like this horde coming in from the south. Oh no, they're part of the zombies that were already in front of this door. Hey, this is really getting bad. Dehydrated. Ay, ay, ay. There's gotta be someone with a lighter. There's gotta be. Killed so many zombies. Not a single one of them has a lighter. Let's peel out of here. Oh, no, this driving around the mall is just. Good. Ah! Oh my goodness. Ned's losing his mind here, I think. He's having a moment of folly. Oh, I just ran. No! No! Calm down! What am I doing? I just literally rammed that car and now it's flying forwards. And just crashed into a bunch of zombies. Oh my goodness. This is not going well, ladies and gentlemen. And you know what? I think. We're just better off to head back to the manor at this point and disassemble some... Maybe the oven? Maybe we can build our own mess kit. Screw the lighter. And we have some flash... Oh, the flashlight's still on. Turn it off. So we're zigzagging through the, the planes here. There's a deer! Not that it would have been that bad if we killed it. But we kind of used the meat. So here we're back at the manor. Not much better shape than we were when we left. Perhaps even worse. It's what time is it? It's 10 a.m. and everything's still frozen. All right. Oh, now the toolbox is still in the garage. Fuck. Ah, oh, fuck. There's got to be a lighter. Glow stick. Oh, there's horseradish. It's cold. Does that satisfy my thirst? No, it makes me thirsty. Not that horseradish is. Oh, what about the ketchup? It doesn't give me any quench. Oh! Finally! 
finally oh my goodness we're so thirsty Ned just down three bottles of water there without blinking an eye let's put those on the floor we're a total pig but we don't care ah uh, finally that's the small things in life now we are full and rehydrated but we definitely need to find the way to can I the I don't I need hammering or s of two or more hmm huh. could there be a hammer in the basement maybe but I remember I think there was a lot of zombies here Ooh, graham crackers. Jar of molasses. Ooh, seasoned salt. Very nice. This can be really useful. Um, oh, more stuff for clean water. Can of beer. Oh, yeah, this was like a wine cellar, and these zombies were. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shush you. He actually has a military rucksack? Ooh, it's dirty and almost broken. So what's... Is there anything interesting here? A wooden barrel of Chardonnay. Oh, 2,000 portions? Ooh. So at least one uh, Cabaret Sauvignon dirty. Yeah, but that wasn't... Oh my goodness. Hell yeah. A lot of them are broken, but we have wine till the ends of time. Okay. Let's kill a few zombies here. Ooh, chilly but rising. Very good. Oh, actually, we should be careful. I am able to get take damage. Uh, fat zombie, what's this? An arcade machine. Wow, this is quite the quite the cellar. Oh, got bitten in the right leg. You see a zombie approaching? Yes, stop smashing. Zombie spot, yes. Where? How big is this basement? Jesus! It's a factory? It's a wine factory under this guy's manor? Jesus. Well, I guess it's as big as the first floor in width and height, so. Definitely not a small basement. Let's finish smashing all the zombies because I will not want to kill them again. And we will need to stop running before we run out of breath. What is this? Bearings, plastic chunk, a pipe, power converter, copper wire. You know what? I think we'll have enough copper wire now. 24. Oh, we have three upstairs. Damn it. Oh, but wait. What if I just smash this thing? Yes. Yes. Perfect. Although we're uh, finally full and slacked, we still need to have that electric fire starter. Alright, smash these guys again. They're good. Let's pop open these crates. What is this? A fencing mask. Interesting. Union suit. Oh! Oh! The solution to our freezing problem. Let me get this straight. This goes over my torso, arms, and legs. Gives me 35 warmth and only takes one encumbrance because it's nice and fit. Yeah, as you'll notice, some items of clothing will have fits in parentheses. That means that it's actually your size, so to speak. Uh, if you upgrade a, a piece of item, not all of them, but some of them, you'll be able to also add the fits uh, attribute to it. So... Okay, let's 
Let's see, am I wearing anything other on my torso or legs? Uh, long sleeve shirt. Let's take that off. Take off the shirt. And maybe the long underwear bottom? Yeah, yeah, that's too hot. Both of them will probably be too hot. Well, I say that, but we're always freezing. So, ah, that's whatever. Let's put on the suit. Uh, it's X wear. But we will take off the long sleeve shirt. Take off. So, how does it look now? Ah. Yeah, definitely better. 10 minus 12. Now that's the head. We need probably some. Oh, our backpack is almost ripped to shreds. Huh, we're gonna have to repair that. Sheet and pillow. A waffle iron and a glass plate. Ah, uh, another zombie. Yeah, I'm gonna stop uh, just running into zombies and smashing them like a tank. Because obviously they're getting swings and and even if I don't get damage most of the time, they sometimes hit my backpack. And if the backpack rips, then we're gonna have to come back and pick everything up manually. <coughs> Ooh, winter coat that fits. <coughs> my God, there's a lot of uh, what is this? A television. That's fine. Hold on. That. Pots oh, a wool scarf. Okay, perfect. Let's drop the knit scarf. Take you, wool scarf, where, where is it now, uh, wolf scarf, wolf, <laughs> a wolf scarf, yeah, that's it, wool, activate, oh, I loosen it, no, 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 I want it tighten, the wool scarf is tighter around your face, exercise machine, sofas, sweatshirt, panties and bra, Hoodie and a dress. Fur hat. There we go. There we go. Where is it? Uh, clothing. Fur hat. See where. E. Our head is. Oh, it's the damn chainmail armor. I wish it was like not one whole piece, and then we could. Uh, Aluminum bat. Very nice. A towel. Perfect. If we get wet, we'll be able to dry ourselves. Oh my god, an epic laundry room. Oh, nice light powder. Ammonia. Bleach. Casings of 45. What? locked man we need to I need to go dump stuff in the car we're full ah let's just push forward come on I know the door oh I'm trying to pry <laughs> I'm trying to pry the door open with my pocket watch yeah that's not gonna work there we go crunch Oh, an office. Blood-soaked rag. Uh, copper pot. A canning pot? Whoa. Can store 25 liters. Okay, what's this? Glass jar. Basketball. A cotton hat. Yeah, maybe the cotton hat will be better than the wool hat. I guess the wool hat's too too big, considering we have the chainmail coif. Although, if you think if you think about it, putting a wool hat over a chainmail coif wouldn't be that bad, right? Fit nicely. Look a bit weird, but hey, it's the apocalypse. It's not about looking fashionable. For now, we'll work on that. Oh no, what's going on here? They did a huge cave-in or something. Uh, you know what? You, you can you can stay there. I don't need anything here, do I? 
more towels, more Jesus, all the linens you'd ever want. Uh, okay. Some more pipe room, sewage pump. Ooh, fishing waters. Hmm, that might be interesting. We'll leave them there. We're fine for now. Whoa. Oh, a huge fireplace. Four fireplace in the cluster. Damn. Could really get things uh, heating up in here. Children's book. Hairpins. A whistle. Yeah. I don't know what a whistle, why I would want to use a whistle. I guess to create diversions. Okay, 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 okay. Is everybody smashed? I hope. Look all these packs of cigarettes and no lighters. Ooh, okay. Lots of stuff to drink here. Alright, let's head on back up. Let's head on back up by here. Ah, okay. It's all linked. Expendable baton. Oh yeah, that's the thing. I... Ned sees his old baton laying in the floor of the manor, remembering his last visit here. Okay, so let's, let's load up the car. And can I craft it, the electric uh, fire starter? Yes, I can. Do it. Oh, but there's no more room in my inventory. Okay, well, let's start dumping stuff from the, out here. Uh, keep the gun. We don't need a towel. Let's put the unused flashlight. Sleeve shirts, winter gloves. Season salt, we'll keep the meat jerky. Put the book. Yeah, let's bring the can. Who cares? 400 duct tape. Wow, that's really good. Uh, do I have a sewing kit? I don't think I found a sewing kit yet. No, wait, I do. How did I make the backpack? A tool with sewing of one or more. Ah, oh, okay, I was using a needle. Is that is that needle still here? Uh, I would have think it is. Oh, fresh bacon. Tempting. Eat it. Eat the fresh bacon. Hopefully it's cooked. All right, so we got the electric fire starter, uh, which we don't need for now. Okay, uh, I, I don't think making a needle was really hard, so. Oh, wood, I just need splintered wood. There's tons of that everywhere. Just find something that was smashed, make something smashed, a so, sew, needle, a wooden needle. Can't craft this thing. Oh, fine. Here. Step into the light. You hear a child shrieking. No. Ugh. Probably a zombie child. Meh. But I've killed all of them. Right? Ah, oh, great. Ugh. Fucking crawling zombie. Oh, no. What's a Kraken? It's moderately injured. This is some form of eldritch monstrosity. An uncouth black being with smooth, oily skin and unpleasant horns that curve inward towards each other. Tall and thin, the shadows cling unnaturally to its vaguely defined humanoid form. Okay. It's fleeing. Perfect. Maybe the zombies and that thing don't get along. <coughs> What's the crawling zombie doing? He didn't see me. He didn't see me. Perfect. Uh, okay. Uh, let's keep bringing stuff into the car. I oh, know I already done that. Right? Oh, I have plenty of space. Let's go get more 
There's a winter coat down there. Let's go get that. Ah, finally he did see me. He stepped into the window frame. No. Ha! You're dead. Ah, oh, great. Oh, shh. Ah. Oh, that was stupid. I even smashed the window frame itself. You want to keep the window frame? Because although you going through it slows you down, it also slows down the zombies a lot. And killing zombies in window frames is the best thing. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, let's go downstairs. Let's, let's go downstairs right here. So, anything of interest? The power converter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can get that. That'll be useful. Circuit board, maybe later. Not for now, but... Let's grab a beer. Energy drink. And... Six bottles of clean water. Okay, that takes a lot of space, but that's no problem. We'll go dump it right away. Herbal tea. Fruit juice. We'll have to drink a cranberry juice. Sports drink. Yeah. Alright, let's... I should make a duffel bag for these things. So you can carry a lot of stuff and not care that you're... Oh, wait, wait. What's the food like here? Tin can of chicken. Ooh, a plastic bag of salt. Can we pick it up? Yes, we can. Alright, fine. What about this funnel? No, it's too big. Let's go back to the car. Hopefully by the time we go back home, what time is it? 2.22 p.m.? Oh, we're fine. Yeah, yeah, no. I <laughs> grabbed the pickup. Yeah. <laughs> what? Uh, drop. Drop everything in there. Yeah, even the meat jerky. Circuit board power converter. Uh, wooden needle. Yeah, it's fine. For now, cash cards and the gun. Perfect. Bandage. That's better than makeshift bandage. Let's pick that. Sheriff's shirt. Ooh, riot helmet and a holster. Hmm, interesting. Alright, let's go back down. So much stuff here. What was this room? Ooh, ooh, ooh hacksaw. Will take a small a pair of rubber boots. Man, this is this will be nice later. I don't want to waste time. Oh, this small string and sinew all over the place. It's so weird. Oh my god, there was even more stuff to explore. And this place is insane. Canning pot. Frying pan. Starting to see some some of the same items coming back. I guess it's oh, in it, two in its cars. If ever we rip ski pants, electric thermal electrical. Oh, how much encumbered? Zero. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, take off the fur hat. Put on the thermal electric baklava. Put the chainmail over it. Ah, oh, again, the backpack was over everything. Shit. So the union suit is underneath the chainmail armor. Boxer, long wear, union suit, chainmail, socks and boots. Chainmail completely at the bottom. All right, should be good. Perfect. It's not giving us more encumbrance, and when we turn it on, it will heat us up when it's cold. Eh? I saw a heating face mask. Does that even exist? People have a, a baklavas that heat up. That seems a little weird. I'd be afraid of using that thing. A screwdriver set, why not? Cardboard of raw spaghetti. Ah, oh, it's raw though, it's not dried. Alright, let's keep exploring this 
ginormous basement. Smash. Scissors. I don't need scissors. A lot of cookware. What are the people doing in this house? Anything in here? Bag of fast noodles. Why are all these noodles not dried? They're all fresh. Ooh, two backpacks. Where are all the backpacks? Are we wearing all of them? Really? Okay, only one. We're wearing two backpacks. Our encumbrance is probably, yeah, horrible. As long as we're not using, losing stamina as we walk, we're fine. A coffee maker. Perfect. Can use that to boil water. Heat up food. Uh, maybe not food. I think I used the, there was a, there's an atomic version of that, which basically has infinite power. And I think... Uh, what, what's that? A cigarette butt. Well, that's poorly designed. How am I supposed to get... Oh, okay, there's another door there. Ooh, let's not go there, because I remember there's a bunch of zombies. What's that? Kabuto? No! An ornamental suit of Japanese samurai armor. Oh yeah. A medieval Japanese helmet with a scowling face mask. Oh yeah. A full samurai armor, Nodachi. This is a huge curved two-handed sword from Japan. It is surprisingly light for its size and also much bendier than a sword should be. Uh. It has rapid strike, block, and wide strike. Dude. 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 Nice. Ah. Uh. Wow. Okay. Okay, this is good. Sadly, we're going to have to end the episode here for now. But I think we're leaving Ned in a good position. Just found a storeroom with a full samurai armor kit with a crazy sword Ooh, I'm loving this this medieval armor and weapons we're finding <laughs> gonna turn ourselves into a post apocalyptic post apocalyptic samurai so Ned's getting a, a promotion from mall cop to super samurai so thank you very much for watching you have all been amazing and uh, stay tuned for next time are we gonna dress up Ned as a samurai or keep this chainmail I didn't check the stats, but we'll see. See you next time.